Hey guys, I just tried to try something new out, so I'm gonna be just playing Sonic 2 for the Master System. Um, this game's actually really hard, and I actually have my reverse and fast forward turned off. And I might as well turn off my quick save and quick load. Alright. So basically, Tails is captured, you gotta go save him. This game isn't very long, it's about the length of Sonic 1. It has six zones, three acts each. There's an additional seventh act if you get, uh, whatever. The six Chaos Emeralds, which are in the six zones. Um, let's just get started. Underground Act 1, you just... This game's fun. Oh, by the way, this game's also really hard. So, if you're not patient, you will be pissed. Also, there's a lot of fake walls everywhere. And, yeah. Alright. Oh, where am I going? So, this was actually the first version of Sonic 2 released. It came out a month before the Genesis version. Um, I've heard this isn't as hard and as fucking died. For this isn't as hard as the uh, Game Gear version where the screen crunch is absolutely terrible. But I digress. And I died. I think I already said that. Ooh. So this right here is probably the most well-known track in the game. Underground Zone. It's the first zone. It's kind of a weird choice for a first zone, but... Whatever. Oh shit. Also a bunch of minecarts everywhere. Oh shit. You basically need like that one ring because the Master System isn't nearly as powerful as the Sega Genesis. It was more powerful than the uh, Nintendo Entertainment System, but it is nowhere near as powerful as the Sega Genesis. So only like a few rings drop out at a time, even though you lose all of them. Um, same goes for the Game Gear, which is basically a portable Master System. And it also had some uh, exclusive games that um, uh, the Master System didn't get. It got um, uh, Sonic Triple Trouble... Uh, Dr. Robotnik's Mean Bean Machine. Got Sonic Blast. Got Sonic Labyrinth. Um, oh, wait, no. Um, Master System did get Sonic Blast. So it's basically two acts of, like, normal stuff, then a boss act. You don't get rings in there anyway, so one hit and you're dead. It's basically Death Egg. A lot of Death Egg. From, from the 16-bit Sonic, dude. I'm pretty sure it's the same way in the 8-bit Sonic 1, but I'm not sure. Um, I haven't played that in a while. Um, second act of Done. Um, also this, uh, teal background, I don't know what the fuck that is. It's probably something with the game. Um, it's because, um, the Master System version was only released in, like, Europe and shit. Um, us Americans only got the Game Gear version, which was a bit of a shame, but, like, whatever. Um, along with some more, uh, Game Gear exclusives, um, uh, both Sonic Drift games. I fucking died again. Ah, suck the shit. Alright. Fucking hell. My only option to, like, die? Duh, fucking hell. Man, leap of faith. Fucking hell. God, God fucking damn it. Alright, round two. Baby. Going through the same shit again. What the fuck? 
There's a lot of trial and error in this game, and, like, especially towards the later zones, like, this game gets very fucking unforgiving. Even it, even the first zone, it's pretty unforgiving. Because that third or act, because, like, that part of the third act right there, I think you're supposed to be saved by Robotnik there, but I'm not sure. Because I know that's the boss act. I make mean, it's pretty simple stuff. Um, two acts, then a boss act with no rings. Um, if you're playing this on the Game Gear especially, you will die a lot because this game is incredibly unforgiving. And the screen crunch is absolute crap there. I'd say it's even worse than the Genesis version of Sonic 2. Alright, act one cleared again. Um, I do have to say, I love the music in this game. Like, I do not, like, hate a single track. Like, the chip tunes here are fucking astounding. Holy shit, I fucking survived that. How? Speedrunners, contact me. No, I'm just kidding. Suck at that shit. Alright, second act done. So there's actually different stuff that could, like, appear on the signpost, depending on what you have. I'm pretty sure... Most common thing is a Robotnik, nothing happens. Or Eggman, whatever. Robotnik Eggman. No one really gives a shit. Um, there's also rings, which grants you ten rings. Um, there's also Sonic, I think. Which... Um, fuck. Oh, I have to jump out of that. I'm dead. Yeah, I have to jump out of that. <laughs> Fucking hell. That was the fastest thing I've ever done with that. <gasps> Fucking hell. I jumped a bit too... Late. No, early. Oh, I thought I died there. Cut. I can't believe they put something like that in the first zone. And Robotnik Eggman, whoever, Identity Crisis comes to save you. I'm just gonna call him that for now. Identity Crisis. Um, this boss is pretty easy to sh jump over these things. You win. And th th fucking hell, I die again. Game over. <sighs> Bunch of keys tapping. Because I, I play all the games I have on my channel on an emulator because I don't have a capture card. Okay, that was wonderful. That was also wonderful. There also are no um, uh, special stages in this game. Unlike uh, the Apex Sonic one. Uh, the cool, cool, cool tips right there. Um, step number one. Jump out of the minecart on a straight section. You'll jump back in it. Sonic 2 8-bit. Cool tips. You'll die a lot. Good luck. I'm pretty sure the standard for speedrunning this level is 16 seconds, which I can only hope to do because I play this shit casually. And as with all the 8-Bit Sonic games, the score is done in a separate screening, unlike um, the Genesis ones, which are done like in the like. Oh, hey, you cleared X act. Time to add up your score. A few of those, they don't do it in. Like, uh, I, I don't... Wait, what the fuck am I saying? 
I don't know. Um. See, Sonic Two Cool Trips. Don't don't run into enemies. Get the ring boxes. Just just get the ring boxes. Holy shit! I did not know that was there. Okay, so you find the Chaos Emeralds in uh all the acts here. Um, if you get all six of them, um, you get to access the seventh zone. Seventh zone, but if you don't, you don't get to access it. Your adventure ends off at the boss act of Scrambled Egg Zone. It's actually, it's just a lot of tubes, tubes everywhere. Pretty sure the Chaos Emerald also grants you a one up. All right. Let's go, baby. Um, third time's the, no, more like seventh time the charm. Ha ha! All right, identity crisis. What have you got in store for us? The first boss is self-defeating. Like. There's nothing interesting to it, just jump over the balls. That's it. You can see how much health he has left by how fast he, like, does his shit. And that's the end of the act. You break open a Robotnik thing. That's it. Underground zone is finished. But what have we got in store next? Sky high zone. This zone. Um. This zone. I'm, I'm not really sure how to describe it. Also, I think I almost just died. So... I, I avoided death. Yay. Um, all the bosses in this game are actually pretty easy. Unlike the rest of the game, which are actually... By the way, this invincibility f music. I love it. And then I die. Can't stand on anything. Hey, at least there's an extra life. You can't stand on the clouds. Apparently, uh... The thing also prevents you from, um, dying in a pit. Neat. Alright. Hang glider. This thing controls like ass. Like, I'm not even fucking joking. This thing controls like absolute ass. And also that apparently counts as a Bike pit. Just fucking weird. So I really only have one more try to do this again. Because there's so little tiles remaining. And so few rings left. I have two ring... Three... So basically you just gotta... Is that good? This thing controls, like... Hey, I did it. In a record time, as in record slow. Yeah. I still get a 9100 time bonus, though. Which is neat. Um, if, in this game, if you get a, if you get a time under 25 seconds, you get a 300,000 time bonus. Ah, oh, you're fucking kidding me. Mate, no, I don't have the time for this. You basically have to hold, like, up. It. I die. No, I don't. You have to make a lot of leaps of faith in this game. Um, these clouds, like, I don't know what you can and can't stand on. I think it has to do with, like, what... Okay, never mind. My pattern was, uh, deeply flawed. I am, I am very sorry for that. Oh boy, more Hank glider. I'm pretty sure it only appears in this act, though. 
Don't. Fuck. Eh. This is probably gonna be like a one, maybe two parter if this if this lasts long. Like I might just go to like third or fourth song, and you know what? I'm just gonna probably call it quits for now, cause. I got shit to do. We all have shit to do. Um, once you know how to control this thing, it actually isn't the worst thing in the world. And I thought I died again. This level seems to be very, very tall. And you can't stand on a lot of this. Fuck. Um... Let's try this hang glider section. Game. No, no. Fuck! <sighs> Clicked on something. I did not remember this act being too hard. Um, you basically have to master the shitty controls of the hang glider. Otherwise, you will die. Like, there is no doubt about it. If you cannot master this shit, you will die. Nothing more to say. Just like that. Also, the invincibility time is significantly shorter than in uh, the Genesis games. Apparently. Okay, that helped. You know what? Oh fuck, I have a continue? I did not see that coming. Okay. Three more tries to fail. Ah, uh, boy. The game's actually really fucking hard. Heck, the only reason I cleared it was I had the reverse, and I have both of them turned off. Reverse and fast forward. Oh, reverse mainly. And I have those turned off, so I'm basically going at this... Um, like I would with an actual master system. Y you see? See that? This- that section is absolute bullshit. Uh, I'm pretty sure with a well-timed well enough jump, you could theoretically get to the other side. But I don't quite know. Y the game has a lot of instances like that or you just die a lot of death fuck this hang glider controls horribly and this is my last life if I die here I might just call it quits because I've wasted seven lives on the song oh I'm fucking dead same fucking place Yeah, I'm just going to call it quits for now. Anyways, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. See you.